We did need the cubic, I remember. So we want where it's increase and decrease and max and then concave will come here down at inflection points. Oh, okay. A bit tedious. Okay, let's look at the first and second derivatives. Starting with two, two, four. First derivative would be two x minus six, and the second derivative would be two. So increasing when this is positive. Uh, 6 over 2 is 3, so increase in when x is more than 3, decrease in when x is less than 3, and it's a minimum when x is equal to 3, and it's always um, concave up because the second derivative is positive okay that's the first one done now two two five first derivative would be three x squared minus 12 x and you want that to equal zero so that means you'll want x uh, times x minus 4 equals 0. 3x squared minus 12x. Yeah. The second derivative will be 6x minus 12. Oh, and this one here has no inflection. Say that. Okay. So... Zero is a negative, so it's a max. So it's a max. Um, there, I don't think I can do this out of headache. It's a max uh, when x is zero, and then it's a min when x is four. It's increasing. when this is positive, which means when x is more than zero and x is more than four, so some x is more than four, it's decreasing when this is a negative, which means it could be that x is less than zero. No, because then that would be a negative. Oh, yes, yeah, so there's the second answer here. X is less than zero. It's decreasing when this is a negative, which will happen when X is between zero and four. Uh, concave up. When the second derivative is a positive, well, let's get the inflection point. So the inflection is at two. And then the concave up. That's when the second derivative is negative, less than two. And then concave down, more than two. Man, I hope that's right. 
Uh, increase in when it's less than zero or more than four. Decrease in between zero and four. Maximum at zero, minimum of four. Concave up when more than two, concave down when less than two, inflection at two. Okay, that's good. Right, two, two, six. Two, two, six. Uh, the first derivative is 4x cubed minus 18x squared. 4x cubed minus 18x squared, which equals zero. So and take out two so that would be x squared times two minus nine uh 